We are at Arkansas's famous Crater of Diamonds State Park and the treasure hunt continues. Yeah, every day we have a treasure hunt for natural occurring diamonds out here, but the park has added an additional treasure hunt to make it additionally exciting out here. So to celebrate the 50th year that the Crater of Diamonds has been in Arkansas State Park, uh, local merchants donated wonderful gifts, uh, sarukas, uh, diamonds, um, hotel stay, uh, coupons for local restaurants or a boat rental up at the lake, uh, different wonderful prizes worthy of, of uh, the effort to win. Um, they took five yellow bottles and put a certificate inside redeemable at the Diamond Discovery Center for your prizes and they hid them on the diamond search field. Well, we've got 37 acres. Well, the hunt has been on for a month and people haven't found it yet. So the park recently published this map that narrowed down the search. So it is not in any of the blacked out areas. It's only in these other sections. So you know where, where to search. Well, still nobody found a bottle yet. And I searched just yesterday. And then after probing and digging and checking and hoping, trying to find a bottle and coming up empty again, uh, that afternoon the park published a new map that narrowed the search down even more. And you can see on the map it must be in this area, this area, or here. Whoops. Uh, this is, let me make sure you can see this treasure map that I've got. But this is the southern portion, kind of down near the John Huddleston shovel marker. This is the west drain area, and this is over here close to, uh, there's the Diamond Discovery Center, so it's just right to the right here. Um, so anyway, there could be, there are five bottles still buried out there, and it's either there, 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 or there. Now, because they released this map, the park is now free to plow more of their search field because before, if they plowed it, you would know, well, the bottle must not be there because they wouldn't plow it and till up their own buried treasure. So now, since they released this information and said it's not in these areas, as you'll see, the bulldozer is working in the background to till up a lot of the area that people were searching in for the bottle. But uh, the treasure hunt continues, and you really ought to come out and find some of these great prizes that are still buried here in a very small area. You don't have a huge area to check anymore. So come join the double treasure hunt. And who knows, while you're looking for a buried bottle, you might even find a diamond.